Hey everybody, welcome to my usual me and welcome back to Green Hell where it is day... It's day nine, but it's six o'clock in the morning right now, guys. I've been up for about three hours and we went ahead and I gathered a whole bunch of the sticks and logs and things that were littered around that we'd left behind. And so after scouring the woods here for a minute, I've got about, oh, I'd say about 60, 50 or 60 sticks right here. I don't have quite as many small sticks, but... Uh, I do have a bunch of rope here. Matter of fact, let me go ahead and drop this. Actually, I don't, you know, yeah, we'll drop these ropes. That's fine. Real quick here. Let's go ahead. And I don't have the the containers to hold them just yet, but we'll get that going here in just a little bit. Maybe not this episode, but probably the next one. And I wanted to talk to you today, guys, about, oh, hang on. Let me get rid of that. All right. I wanted to talk to you guys today about um, metal or no metal. Is it worth it? Should you bother with it? Um, and there's, you know, there's there's two sides of the of every coin, right? Um, there's my charcoal right here. Let's go ahead and let's grab all the all the charcoal out of there that I can, and all of our campfire ash. Now, uh, a lot of people are gonna say, yes, you do want metal. Um, I am of a separate mind. I've I'm I, I've I've messed with the tools and the weapons and the armor long enough to know that. Um, for the amount of effort that goes into getting metal and making metal, it's probably not going to be your best bet, at least not right off the bat. Most of that has to do with the fact that every time you make something, you get better at it. So, I mean, it depends on what you want to focus on right away. If you want to focus on metal right away and you want to get better at it, that's great. Right now, my durability on my, on my metal armor legs are 41 and... 35 right it's going to gradually get better as i make more and more so and but it'll cap out at a certain point so uh and i don't remember what the cap is right now so if you're asking me in this video uh, in the comments i don't remember it's been a while now the next best armor in the game is armadillo armor and uh what we're going to do is uh, you want to get the best spear you can get in the game which is going to be metal most likely but uh the next best spear is going to be obsidian and I do have a piece of obsidian right here. Let's go ahead and make an obsidian spear because it's much, much better than this piece of garbo I've got sitting right here. Where is it? This uh, stone spear, that's at 25% durability. It's not very good. So, and this is actually going to, this is going to go away. I'll lose durability on that spear till it disappears. Um, but I'm not worried about that because I just don't, I'm not going to worry about it. Let's go ahead and grab a, where's my, here we go. Let's grab a, a rope right quick, a liana. And let's grab a long stick right quick and um, actually drop it and let's craft. And then all you really need, and you can get your you can get your obsidian at almost any of the caves. Uh, there's a couple caves that don't give obsidian and it's kind of random. But once you figure out where the obsidian is, it shouldn't be a problem for you to find it. So uh, I got this obsidian from the scorpion cave earlier. Let's go ahead and... In an earlier episode, if you know where the scorpion cave is across the river, um, let's go ahead and craft that and see what the durability is on this right quick. This durability right here is 36%. So every time I make a spear, it's going to get a little bit better, a little bit better. Now, I'm going to make a metal spear today, and we're going to we're going to see what that does. But um, I'm and I don't know if it's if it's by the material or if it's by the item. Because like the last one. My last spear, I think, was like 30, 32%. Now, this is at 30, what did I say? 36? 36. So what we're going to do is, now that I have charcoal right quick, we're going to go ahead and let's feed this. And we're going to make, I'm going to put in, I think, what did I say? Four last time. Four for that one. And then this, these are almost done. So we're really only going to put in, um, like, I think, two. I'll put in two in each of these because these are almost finished. So that'll, and I don't want to overdo it because it's just going to burn itself out. Not really that big of a deal. Do I have, I've got one dry leaf. Do I have, okay, so I only got one dry leaf. Let's go ahead and let's, we'll finish one here. Actually, this is going to be the metal. Let's do the metal first. Let's go ahead and go uh, use the hand drill. I'm going to go ahead and make a torch too. I don't know if I can light one forge off of the other with a torch i'm hoping that i can but i don't think i can it won't really matter i can build a fire right quick so this one's cooking so let's go ahead and let's see if we can make a, a torch right quick to make a torch we need a 
large stick and a liana. Just a basic torch. If I had some uh, sap, I could make a, a better torch, but we don't need to worry about that. Not for what we're doing here. So we're just going to go ahead and go craft. And like this, and that's a weak torch. We're going to grab that. And I'm going to drop this rusty axe right quick just so I can do this and put it in my hand. We'll get the axe in a second. So let me see if I can light this off of this. I don't think I can. Whoops. Oh, shit. No, I can't. If I hit this too many times, I'm going to destroy it. So I can't light this off of the other. But let's go ahead and grab a bunch of sticks right quick, and we'll make a new fire. But I need to find... Actually, I need to find a... A nest. I could find a bird's nest around here somewhere. Or I might have to find some Molinaria so I can break it down into fiber. Uh, there was a bird's nest in this one, too. Is there another one? Uh, log back in. They've changed it. Used to be every time you log back in, all that stuff would re-up. Re so that's not the case anymore. So we're going to have to find... We're going to have to find um, some Liana. Here it is. Uh, not Liana. Molinaria. My bad. I can, make, I can make fiber out of this. So we're going to just make fiber out of it. Because I've got bandages right now. So we're just going to harvest this. That'll give me fiber. We're going to do that three times to give me enough to light a couple fires. And there we go. I don't really need these flowers. So we're probably just going to put them up here to dry out on their own. Like, I don't need these flowers. We're just going to drop them right there. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. So, let me grab some big sticks, some small sticks. I think I need, what, six of each? Eight of each. Eight. And we'll grab eight of these. All right. And to make the head I need for the metal spear, as soon as this is done, we're going to... Um, it is lit, right? Yeah, okay. We'll put the fire over here like we do. And go ahead and just drag this out of the way. My favorite spot to put a, uh, a fire in this area. All right. Go ahead and light this. Hey. Come here. Come on. All right. We'll light that. And then we'll just go ahead and we'll use our torch. Oh, it's three. Okay. And we'll go ahead and ignite this. And then we can go ahead and we can light that mud forge and this mud forge there we go i'm gonna go ahead and just dunk this in the water it should put it out that's a lit torch don't know if that put it out or not i think it did yeah we're 96 percent on this torch i'm gonna leave this torch right here just so i have it for later then i'm gonna go back and i'm gonna grab my axe because i i want to keep my axe where i know where it's at actually i think i'm gonna put this axe up top here i was gonna test the axe and see if i could use it for a um, to make another metal axe I don't know if I can or not okay here we go there's my armor mold and there's my other armor mold I'm gonna go ahead and just break that up we're gonna harvest that one and then while this is burning we're gonna just chuck this back in there boom and let me add a couple more charcoal onto that because I'm gonna need to that's all the metal I've got right now so now I can go and I can gather more metal every time I log in uh, at the caves, but I'm not going to worry about that right now. Right now, as soon as this is done, we're going to go ahead and we're going to... Actually, let me harvest this other one. We're going to make ourselves a spearhead. Then we'll finish our armor. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to harvest this. Two of them are gonna, oh, wait. All three of them fell? I can't grab any of them? I don't have any room, huh? Our tobacco leaf, I'm going to harvest that. Okay, so I got three fiber out of that? Really? No way did I get three. No. Oh, I have three fiber. I didn't get three fiber. I have three fiber. So let's go ahead and let's take this. Boop. There we go. And so then what we're going to do is I'm going to use the mold. I'm going to use the 
uh, stone blade, and I'm going to use the um, the metal that's coming out of here so that I have. Um, oh, I may need I may need to actually put another charcoal in there. We're going to make ourselves a metal um, metal blade mold is what we're going to do. So that's going to be a minute. And actually, I'm just going to keep this burning here because let that burn out. I don't have any more metal. And then I'll use this same forge to plop, plop this into it. So we should have enough to make my blade, I think. I have four charcoal left. Yeah, we should be, we should have enough. I think we're going to be fine. Um, this is going to take a minute, though. All right, so anyway. It's almost done. I'm just going to hang out for a second. How's my food looking? I can use a little bit of everything, huh? All right, well, we can take a little snack while we're waiting. Actually, it just popped out. There we go. Take the middle of the ore. Grab the mold. Let's go ahead and go. That's spoiled. Let's go ahead and destroy that. Uh, actually, let me eat this right quick since I'm here. I don't have dirty hands, so we're good. Um, nuts. I think I'm good. All right, cool. And then go here. Uh, craft. Along with that piece of metal. And the blade that I have. Right there, and that's going to give me a blade mold. All right, so we've got a blade mold, mold working. And somebody had made a, uh, a comment. They said that uh, you get your item back that you're using the mold for. You didn't used to. It used to destroy it, but now you get it back, so it's great. Um, at least I think it used to destroy it. Somebody probably might correct me on that, but I believe it used to, which is why I said what I said in the last episode. All right, campfire ash we can put over here because I'm going to keep this with its brethren. I'm going to use that for more mud in the future. There we go. And all these feathers I'm going to drop over here while we're waiting for this stuff to do its thing. Let's go ahead and just drop this whole stack of feathers here. But it didn't fall through. If it did fall through, it's not a big deal, but it's fine. And then now while we're waiting on this, I'm going to make the rest of my armor. And then we'll go ahead and we'll make... We're going to compare durabilities with different materials is what we're going to do. So, let me see here. Um, I need rope. That's what I need. And I need two more sets of armor. So, I think I need it's either four or six. I think it's four. It's four. So, because I need two for each. So, we'll go ahead and we will uh, craft with the banana leaf. Then we'll go one, two, and three with this. And grab two of these guys. Craft that, craft that. And then that's our metal armor. The durability on that one is 48%. We're going to do this again. I'm not worried about that little rustling sound because... That's the armadillo. They become like a friend to you after a while. The only thing I'm concerned about when I'm doing stuff like this, what the heck just happened here? Oh, I, I did a blue bandage by mistake. Okay. Give me the armor. Now we do the rope. If I do a, a lot of uh, crafting all at once, I'm afraid that a native will sneak up on me. Especially if I've had some fires going for a while. See, this is 53%. So we're going to go ahead and I'm going to go and we're going to put this armor on here. Now I've got the best armor in the game, but do I have the best armor in the game? Not really, because um, we got an achievement. Yay. Uh, Alright, so this is really, really slow. A lot slower than I was expecting. Let's do this. I may not have the charcoal for this, guys. Actually, yeah, I will, because that'll be a, a metal blade that I'm going to get out of that. And then this is just going to be smelted metal. So I would need to do anything else. I'm going to need more charcoal. It takes a lot of charcoal to make metal. That's my point, is do you want to bother with metal? It takes a lot of wood. Depends on, on, on the time you've got. Depends on your location. And my suggestion to you is to wait until you get your crafting up. There we go. There's the blade right there. All right, so let's go ahead and let's harvest this. 
All right, so we've got one cast metal blade right there. I can turn into a metal spear. Now, the spear I've got on me right now, like I was talking about, is 36%. Now, we're going to make another spear, and we're going to see what the durability is on that. If it goes up, then it's by the item. Whoops, that's not what I want. That's what I want. If it, go, if it's if it goes down, then it's by the material. I think it's by the item. Craft. But I haven't ever, I don't, I don't think I've ever tested this. Um, and then the metal blade. And then this guy, metal spear. We're going to compare these two side by side. All right, so now we've got a metal spear. This is 36%. This is 37%. So it is by the item. So every time you make a spear, your durability will go up. Every time you make an axe, no matter what kind, your durability will go up. Um, anytime you make a knife, a stone blade, or a blade, your durability will go up. The 41% for this, this blade and the blade right here should be higher. Where is it? Where'd it go? Where's my, where's my blade, dude? Did it go in here? Oh no, I made a spear. Damn it. <laughs> I couldn't tell. Oh, never mind. I should have I should have checked my blade before I made it into a spear. Too late. Not a big deal. That's fine. Both of these are respectable spears. Um, the metal spear is going to be the best. Obsidian is the next best. But I'm going to use the metal spear to go and uh, get ourselves an armadillo now. Actually, you know what? I don't have to burn this. Let's go ahead and take um, a coconut. Let's go grab some water right quick. Some dirty water. We're going to put this out. I don't need it. I don't need a waste of firewood, guys. All right, so we're going to kill ourselves an armadillo. He's going to die real quick. That's a metal spear. He should go down really fast. There he is. All right. Now, it's going to take, for one piece of armor, it's going to take one armadillo uh, shell. Um... I think it's two um, banana leaves, and I think it, or no, it's, is it two banana leaves and two um, liana, I think? I think. We're going to double check that. I'm going to grab three liana just in case. It might be three rope. I think it's two. I think it's one, two, and two. You need three pieces of... You need three pieces of metal to make a piece of armor, but I think, oh yeah, so see, there's only four components here. So it is, it is um, one, one leaf, one armadillo shell, and two liana. Okay. All right. And this is the next best armor in the game. So this is 37% uh, versus the 48%. So really, so armadillo armor and metal armor, it's not the same. So it's not, so with armor, it's different. Because this armadillo armor will get will get better and better as I go along. We can make another piece here in a minute. Let me go ahead and put this down. I'm going to slip this right here. So with the metal, it doesn't matter. With the, with the tools... It looks like with the tools, it's by the item. With the um, with the armor, it looks like it's by the um, the material. Um, however, it might be by the uh, the dur the durability of the material that I'm working because I've worked so much metal that may have brought that the durability of that spear up. So somebody tell me in the comment section if you've tested this out because it looks like it's going to be a little confusing. Uh, there's another armadillo over here. Let's go get this guy. And just double check on it. Is it going to get dark already? Yeah, it's going to get dark in a second. Let's see if we can get this other armadillo in the head. Don't have to chase him. But the whole point is, uh, really, I mean, with the amount of effort that it goes into metal, um, it might not be the, your best bet right off the bat. I mean, like, I, I lo I've... Before they even put metal in the game, I was happy with armadillo armor and obsidian spears. So if you know, I mean, if that is an option for you, I would, I would, I would, I would just like in this area there are more armadillos than than I need to worry about. So there's two here, there's one here and one over there, and then there's another one around the corner there. I don't know where this one is though. 
He is here somewhere. Usually. Might have scared him off. He may not have spawned in this time. Normally there's an armadillo right here. So and anybody who's played the game knows what I'm talking about. If you've been around this area. But yeah, so we okay, so we have our spears. We uh we, we have our our armor. We can pretty much take on whatever without too much worry. Let me go ahead and make a box right quick, guys, before we get out of here today. I'm gonna make a a uh, a mud box. So we can hold some of our items. I think I've got everything I need right here. Pretty sure it shouldn't be an issue at all. Let's go ahead and put a box. Put a box right here. Let's go with um, storage box. It should let me put one in here somewhere. Rotate it. Put it this way. There we go. And we need four <gasps> sticks. There's four sticks. We're going to need uh, some planks, which I have the logs over here for that. There's that. Need four more sticks. To, I mean, because whenever you put something on the ground, uh, if it has a durability, the durability will go down for the most part. There are some items that don't do that. But tools... Will most definitely uh, you lose your durability on it, so you got to be you got to be aware. Things will start disappearing on you. You'd be like, "Where'd they go?" So it's ten sticks, two mud brick. No, one mud brick and um, two planks, guys. I think. Yeah, Need two planks, which I can get from these two logs right here. I don't have enough to do two storage containers, but I got enough for one. And, all right, and then we just go ahead and just go like this. We'll craft, and I'll just move this over. And we'll just put that on the ground. You kind of, you, you need, do like that. You need to be able to put that in your inventory. Oh, it is two mud bricks, okay. That's fine. There we go. All right, I'll go ahead and wash my hands right quick. I'm probably going to need to eat something in a minute. All right. And so let's go ahead and let's grab. I don't think the axe will lose durability, but we're going to put it in there anyway. If I can. I don't guess I can. Because I don't have room. Uh, let's put the, put the bow down right quick. Metal axe. Oh, it won't even let me put it in there. It won't even let me put it in there. So that's not going to lose durability. Otherwise, it would let me put it in there, I think. Oh. I'm not going to worry about it. We're going to leave it there just in case I need an, an emergency axe one of these days. And another piece of metal ore. Yeah, I'm pretty tired. My guy's pretty pretty beat. We did, we did a pretty good job today. We finished our, our metal armor. We finished our metal spear. Um, I... Thought I had a, uh, a a handle on on the uh, the durability of your armor versus your weapons, and it looks like it's a little bit more confusing than I thought. So if anybody has the answer to that, put it in the comment section. But I definitely think that you're better off starting with your obsidian and your armadillo. I wouldn't rush toward metals uh, so quickly. I would try to grab uh, as much metal as you can, stockpile it before you even start, and and get your get your crafting up as high as you can as fast as you can before you start doing metal um i think me uh, you're gonna you're gonna be finding you're gonna be going th burning through a lot of metal products a lot faster rather than uh if you wait and you just craft your items your other items ahead of time if that makes sense anyway guys i hope this helped you out i hope you all enjoyed it if you did give me a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed please do that right now as i always say i am my usual me you be your usual you and we'll see you in the next video Thank you so much for watching, guys. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.